Hello everyone. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I am Putri Marita Apriliani and um, I am a student of Sekolah Tinggi Bahasa Asing Sumedang. And today I'd like to explain about uh, the final my final my final paper and the title is about Morris Dance as a habit of British at the springtime to get rain. All right. Um, there are uh, three points about uh, my explanation and the first point is about uh, what is Morris dance and the second is about history in England and the last point is about Morris dance to bring rain okay for the first for the first point um, is about Morris what is Morris dance so Morris dance is a form of British folk dance that is usually accompanied by music this is based on rhythm rhythmic jumps and the execution of choreographic figures by a group of dancers. It usually wearing bell pads or on their shins. Implementation implements such as takes, swords and hand hanker chief can also be held by dancers. The earliest mention of the horse stance in English is known and still survive that 1448 and record the payment of seven shilling to Morris dancers by the Goldsmith Company in London. In London. All right. Uh, next to the point number two is about history in England. The name and origin of the dance was first recorded in the middle of the 15th century as the Morris dance, Morris dance, Morris dance, which is Moorish dance. I don't know what it is said. And the terms entered in English through Flemish Moorish key dance. Terms that can be compared in other language are German, more Morris cantans, or also from uh, also from the 15th century. French Morris cues. Moresca Croats and Moresco, Moresca or Moresca or Moresca in, it, in Italy and Spain. Modern Morris spelling first appeared in the 17th century. In the mid 17th century, the, the peasants who were to, took part in the Morris dance, especially in the sun. However, the Puritan government, uh, it is Oliver Cromwell, surprised with Sunalis and other celebration. When the crown was restored by Charles II, the Spring Festival was restored, specifically with St. Alice came to be celebrated every Sunday or Pitten Cost because the date um, coincides with Charles II's birthday. Some British folklorists were responsible for recording and reviving the tradition in the early 20th. 1934, the Morris Spring was founded by six sides of this revival. In the 1950s, and especially the 1960s, there was an explosion of a new dance teams, some of them women or mixed sides. At the time, there are often a heat debate about the propriety and even the like legitimacy of women dancing boys. Despite evidence, as far back as the 16th century, there were more female dancers. Uh, now, they are male, female, and makes sight to be found. The last point is about Morris dance to bring rain. A Morris dance is a form of English folk dance, it, it usually accompanied by music. This is based on the rhythmic stepping and implementation of the choreographer figure by a group of dancers. Tools as uh, sticks, swords, and hand chief and bells can also be mobilized by dancers. In a, most, in, in a small number of dance, for one or two people, this is this step is carried out close and in a pair of tobacco pipes placed on each other place on the floor. Morris dance is an English folk dance that is often danced at the village celebrations. Hundreds of years ago, the Morris dance was danced in the spring to bring rain so that the harvest was good. Uh, Alright, uh, this is.
information about more stands. So thank you so much for your attention. Hopefully it is useful. And uh, I'm so sorry if my, my Spanish, but there's many mistakes. So, so I go.